Hello there, people. Today is August 2nd, Sunday, um, 2015. Um, at 6.28 p.m. El Paso time. Yeah, 6.28 p.m. Yeah, I had, had some drama going on. Yeah, as you can see, I have new equipment to record videos and everything. I bought a laptop this like Hewlett Packard laptop it's got like um, much faster it's just much faster overall and stuff it's got one terabyte of memory hard drive memory and it's a 17 inch so it's got a bigger screen but that's about it. what the hell is that and I don't think it's even raining or anything, but because it's not even overcast or it doesn't seem to be overcast. There's a lot of sunlight and stuff, but and there was like thunder I heard coming from the window. I don't know. Is somebody like I don't know bombing or something? But yeah. All right, there have been some interesting developments. Um, yeah, I just wanted to share with you. I've been doing this uh, diet called the HCG diet with the shots. Um, I'm just taking shots because I think they're the most effective. Uh, they go like directly. Um, they are the most, um, basically most effective. And what the hell are those all those noises and shit going on? I hope I hope a freaking uh, world war hasn't broken out yet. Um, yeah, been doing the HCG shot, and yeah, the shots appear to be more efficient. But yeah, um, I was doing the 500 calories a day and stuff. But, organic food like a very strict diet and stuff but those shots help you help to uh, contain your hunger basically and your cravings and stuff you'll be I don't know you'll be pretty full with the you know the little food that you eat 500 calories your body is still getting it is said that your body and it feels like it like your body's still getting plenty of nutrients and like calories and stuff it, you feel like you've been eating just almost like pretty much as you know pretty much the same amount of food like you've been eating as much as you need to quench your hunger basically more or less but you only need actually eat like 500 calories worth of uh, food and there's some other like variations of it and stuff but I did the 500 calorie a day and it was taking like uh, um, was it um, like <sighs> potassium yeah potassium pills in case uh, you know for like because when you like lose weight very fast you might get like cramps in your legs and other places so that helps that takes care of the cramps uh, even though I didn't get any cramps, but I was still taking them like every night. And when I when I would actually remember to take it at night, but yeah, I started back in uh, at the end of May and I finished like a week ago. I didn't fin finish. I just interrupted the diet, but I broke the diet. But yeah, some uh, squabble went down with the healthcare practitioner that I that was uh, administering my diet and stuff. I paid her like. I paid her already. I mean, I paid her to assist me and everything. And apparently, uh, she got pissed off at me for some reason. I know what the reason is. It's a pretty petty reason, but um, I don't know. She seems to be the only one that does that diet here and stuff. It administers that supervises it that people in that diet it's a hcg from dr simeon's back in the 50s 
basically you just trick your body into thinking it's pregnant it starts releasing the fat stores with that hcg stuff and it resets your hypothalamus so that you don't get like uh, insanely hungry and stuff um and yeah it's supposed to like you know, reset your hunger hypothalamus gland that controls your hunger and cravings and stuff and yeah after you're done with this after you do the maintenance and all these other like indications um you're not supposed to get as you know you're supposed to have much less hunger and like just eat a fraction of what you ate before much less and feel fully satisfied and full so yeah that's how it is um yeah but i there's a few like there's a few exceptions as to like who can do the diet i think but yeah always seek uh, at least like uh, supervision from a, a trained professional or even though it's not fda approved so it's kind of like it's kind of uh, it kind of makes it seem like they're not professional no matter who's doing it. But yeah, somebody who's trained and stuff. Yeah, they take blood pressure, your heart rate, all that stuff. Yeah, but I lost like, what, 47 pounds in like 65 days or so. But, you know, I didn't, I don't know, I had a, a few slips along the way and stuff. Some, uh, some intentional and some unintentional. So if not, the weight loss would have been faster but i'm looking for a new place to provider for hcg and stuff and yeah um yeah this uh I don't know, apparently this person where where i started doing this diet is extremely unethical and stuff but hey the diet worked just fine so Yeah, let's not knock the diet. Um, let's knock the unprofessional people that, you know, seek to try to make like money and whatever, and then they don't, they don't do their part of the deal, what is expected of them. All right, yeah, we had a deal and she broke the deal pretty much, but whatever. Yeah, until later is by. Yeah, look into this diet. This is like a magical diet. You will lose at least a pound a day for a male, but it's extremely rapid weight loss. Look, I'm not bullshitting you about this diet. I didn't feel any like bad symptoms or anything. Just weight loss and shit. Like, started thinking, thinking. I used to buy 38 pad size. I, now I'm like less than. Probably like 34, but I buy like 36. No, I was buying like 40 waist size pants. Now I'm like, yeah, the 36 are a lose on me and stuff. I might, I'm gonna try some 34s now. But yeah, I just wear a belt with the 36s because they, they fall down. So, yeah. And I had already heard people that didn't actually do the, diet correctly and they told me they had already discredited the diet they told me all oh, that shit doesn't work but yeah have faith and it will work i promise you this is not just a fucking this is not a fucking scam and yes i've heard all the negative stuff or the like yeah implied negative like things about this diet but still decided to do it yeah i've had i have a history for like you know, people that tell me not to do like some medical procedure and stuff and this is how i fucking fix my flat foot actually um yeah keep in mind that not all doctors are as good you know there's some doctors that are better than others and stuff all you gotta do is you know, if you got a real serious problem all you gotta do is keep searching and more than likely you will get rewarded for your hard search and stuff and persistence. All right, later, bye.